Hello everyone, this is Seraphira, and welcome back to Osiris New Dawn. So there's a few things I have done offline. Uh, I've made the printer. Let's see what that does. Alright, so I can now make my own medical bandages. I can now make my own patch tape. Uh, it makes cloth, the makeshift cloth, and cloth bundles. Apparently cloth bundles need plastic for some reason. Um, or you could use a makeshift bundle and more alien fiber. It's probably the way to go in my opinion. Uh, you can make wire straight up out of gold, copper, and rubber. Um, we'll get to rubber in a moment. Um, hoses with just iron and rubber. I don't know why. I guess you don't, you wouldn't need the broken ones anymore. Um, circuit board straight up with white gold, uh, dime alloy, and plastic and power cells. We'll also get to plastic. Computer screens using the circuit boards. Um, and then things that you could make before. Fuel cells you can now make. Uh, I've got plenty of them at the moment, but if I ever do run low, I can make them here. And landmines are new. So, uh, plus you can do an upgrade to weapon fabrication. Let's go back. So you can make your own bolt rifles, which I don't need since I've looted one. The magazines for it, which I will need. Um, which requires aluminum, titanium, and some steel. It's not too bad. Uh, to make the A51 assault rifle. Heavy assault rifle, excuse me. Um, that magazine, and then assault rounds for other weapons. So, that's the printer. Uh, I also did make the chem station over here. So now you can make your own uh, rubber just using uh, Lonsdalite? Lonsdalite? I don't know. Let's try to pronounce that later. Um, and hydrogen plastic requires sulfur, lead, and hydrocarbon solution. Adhesive, I'm not sure exactly what that's for, but you use tree sap and chlorine. And then here's our um, hydrazine. So hydrogen, nitrogen, and an empty container. Uh, so this is what I'll need to make the rover. I do have the hydrogen, I do have the nitrogen. I think I just need to empty out a glass, one of these water, and I've got plenty of these things that I can empty out. Um, if I wanted to, I could make another glass container with water. Uh, I'm not sure what the fluorescence is for, and I don't know what the hydrochloric acid is for. Um, explosives uh, it should be self-explanatory. Put that in that landmine for sure. Um, and PCX, I'm not sure what that's for. So, these I'm sure we'll get to later. Just not currently. Uh, with the chem station, and I'm assuming the printer, you needed power. So I did make a small solar panel. So that's what I've got going outside. And we'll come back out and build one more thing in a moment. So I did finish the airlock. Uh, I did finish all the, the plates outside. I don't remember if I did that last episode or not. Um, and I added the suit upgrade for the fabricator. Let's open that really quick. So now I'm able to build all these suit upgrades. Now, I guess I'm a little disappointed. I was hoping I could put all of these things into my suit. Let's just look at our inventory really quick. There's a suit system, a mobility system, and a helmet system. I did make, to begin with, the inventory um, improvement, which does give you quite a bit of extra slots. It's like 20, maybe? Could be more than 20 slots. Um, but my battery, if you can see in the bottom right where my toolbar is, uh, is currently full. So you just have to switch them out. It's not that huge of a deal. I was just hoping that you could have multiples at a time. And you can. Unfortunately, by looking at them, I don't see anything that says, hey, this is a suit upgrade. This is a helmet upgrade. I would assume that the light unit is a helmet upgrade. What I guess this improves the lighting system. I, I don't know. I, I guess it, yeah, there we go. Power usage is, 
75% of what it used to be, and the range is even is increased. So that's what the light unit will do for me. Um, again, if I could have multiple suit upgrades at a time, that'd be great. Whatever, that's, it's just not the way it is. Um, yep, so that's what I've got going on in here. Oh, I also made the, the skylight. Uh, when it was night in here and I didn't want to use the battery in my light on my helmet, uh, I couldn't, it was hard to see. And I'm sure if I was recording it, it'd be impossible for you guys to see. The new skylight does allow me to see more, plus it's got a, a built-in light that does turn on when I enter the habitat. So, let's pick up our food because that's working quite nicely. And it'll just continue to grow. And let's go back out and we're going to build one more thing. So, let's see. Let's hit F2 utilities and we're going to build the drill. Um, this is a large mining drill capable of extracting ore from deep in the planet's mantle requires an initial drilling period to break through the crust and prepare a mining shaft. I don't know if there's a front and back to this. I don't think it actually matters if there's a front or back to it as long as I can get to it. Um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it like this. It looks kind of like a stair way. I, I don't know. Um, hoping was hoping it would fit in this little area right here. Nope. I think that's good enough. And build it. There we go. So I've used a lot of material here. Well, apparently this is the front. I can always pick it up and move it. Grinding drilling torso so I can see this from at least this direction. So yeah, okay, I'm gonna move it. Let's pick up the wrench, see if it allows, yep, dismantle. And let's place it again. Where's the that readout? I think it's there. If not, we'll just do it again. Oop. There we go. Okay. So we've got the readout. Let's switch her on after I take the tool out of my hand. And switch it on. All right, there we go. So it does take a little bit of time to move away from the noise. I don't know what that's gonna do for annoying wildlife. Yeah, there's somebody coming. I don't know if they're coming for it or not. Looks like he doesn't like it. Oh, yep. We're getting lots more wildlife. Interesting. I thought that was a cool idea. I didn't think they'd actually have it in there. Um, the walls are protecting it. I don't see them trying to destroy the walls, that I can tell. Let's get... You know, let's just shoot a couple things. wrench out. Uh, actually, the rock wall is taking damage. Not a whole lot, but this one is. Whoa. Dude, stay away from the base. I 
Alright, so we might actually have to protect this. <laughs> inside. What does this say for damage? Anything? It's fine. <laughs> I think it landed on top of the other the other guy and he's trying to get up and he can't. Um Alright, well we'll start harvesting some of these guys. out of the way so I can start shooting the other ones. This is the most aggressive I've seen any of them be. Um, where are we at? 25%? Alright, well, I'm going to speed this up while, while the drill is working. Um, it doesn't look like they're doing all getting through very well, so. There just happens to be a lot of them.
as you can see, it's found its target and it's siphoning mantle. I don't know how long that goes on though. There's no, there's a progress bar, but it keeps on going through and through and keeps on doing it over and over again. We can always turn it off. Might as well. Okay, so now what? Uh, the beastie is going to go away. Well, let's just take him out. Looks like they're still... Whoop. Looks like they're more interested in me now than... Did you just break a wall? Dude! thought I just repaired that, but apparently not. Um, it's okay. It looks like we took them out anyway. Let's just clean everything up. It doesn't appear that things are still coming now that I've turned it off. alien tissue I got during this. Okay, so that, I don't know, that was actually kind of fun. <laughs> um, let's see if we can find some rock. Uh, nope, I don't think it's down here. Nope. There we go. Yeah, I found hundreds of tissue there. Alright, let's... Yeah, let's just start with the normal rock wall, and then we can worry about different defenses later. Um, it needs to be perfect. Good, there we go. Alright, so switch metal switch on. Is there some sort of There we go, drill hopper. Alright, so for all of that <laughs> we found fourteen magnesium and three iron. Um I I don't know. I think if you... It's probably more worth it if... You built up defenses and you got guns firing at things. And I... I don't know. I... <laughs> we'll see. We'll, we'll try that out too. Uh, but for now, that's the, the deep terrain drill... I, I probably would have had uh, found much more product just going out and beating down those nodes around, laying around. Um, Vital stabilized. I would guess that you're going to eventually get more product later. Like, more than just magnesium and iron, and you'll eventually find stuff that's not close to your base, I think. I, I don't know. Anyway, we'll, we'll try that out later. Uh, but for now, that's that's the rich... That's the drill. The deep terrain drill. Um, yeah. Alright. I, I think... Uh, even when I speed this up, we're going to be pretty close to 20 minutes. Uh, so I guess with that said, as always, really thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you guys are enjoying the series, uh, I'm not sure what we got in planned 
for next episode. I guess we'll see that when we get there. Uh, again, thank you again. And I will talk to you all next time. Alright, everyone. See ya. Bye-bye.